Good evening, Janet. How are you tonight? Good evening. Very well. Waiting for you. Okay, I'm here, ready. Yeah, me too. <laughs> okay, Liz. Good evening, Liz. How are you tonight? Good evening, Liz. How are you tonight? Turn your microphone on, Liz. Okay. Turn your microphone on, Luis. Okay, sorry, teacher. Good it's evening. Okay. Don't worry about it. How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. Okay. I have I found a day, a day uh, a little tired today. A little tired day. Don't I'm worry about it. Day. Okay. We are going to relax. Okay, me too. Okay. Well, I had a little more relaxed day. All these days were very tiring. But thanks God, something happened and I had the afternoon off, okay? So I could rest a little bit and be ready with a lot of energy tonight, okay? Good evening, Lester. How are you tonight, Lester? Good evening, teacher, I'm fine, and you? I'm fine, thanks for asking, okay? Very good, guys. Look, the first thing that we're gonna do is that we are going to go to to the book on page, on page 48, which is this exercise. Okay, let me share with you. Can you see it? Not yet. Not yet, okay. Can you see it now? Yes. It's okay. Okay, yes. very good. So free advice. Now you have to pay attention. You have to pay. 
You have to pay attention to the listening. People give advice about three of the things that are right here. CD Walkman, inline skates, motorbike, ATM card, camcorder, or video recorder, and personal watercraft, okay? So you are going to tell me what was the first item and what was the advice that they gave. Is that clear? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. So I'm gonna go to it. Listen carefully, please. Okay, so what was the item? Do you want me to play it again? Please. Please. Yes. Okay, no problem. Advice about three of the things below. Write the name of each item to chart. One, it's best to use a stand when you're filming with this. If you hold it by hand, the picture is often not very steady. Be careful when you put in the battery. If you push too hard, you can actually do some damage. So what is the item? I think it's the camcorder. Yeah, it's the camcorder oh, because it says it's better that you use a stand. A stand is el trípode, right? Yeah. Stand. So you can, when you are filming, because it says if you hold it with your hand, you might move the film. And he said that when you put the battery to be careful. So what is the advice? Camcorder. No, the item is the camcorder. What, is, what was the advice? Uh, Try to use a stand. That is mm. one advice. Another advice? Take care when, when you change the battery. Uh -huh. Be careful when you put the battery. Don't push too hard, right? Very good. Now, the same way we are going to listen to the other, to the other uh, items. Two, remember to wear protective gear whenever you use them. You can easily fall and hurt yourself. And make sure to skate on a flat surface, such as a parking lot, a tennis court, or a basketball court. What item is that? A ATM card. Uh, inline skates. I mean. Ah, inline skates. Okay. What was the advice? Uh, you see it in a. Uh, uh, I don't remember the word. Okay, can you see what I have on the on the screen? Can you see what I have on the screen? Yeah, use protectors. This is protective gear. Okay, that sh that she mentioned. Okay, so what was the advice about the protective gear? What use was the advice? It, use it in the head. I, I... Uh, no, try to use protective gear. You remember, infinitive, try to, try to use protective gear, right? So try to use protective gear. So that was imperatives and infinitives, okay? So try to use protective gears. Now, what was the other advice? Okay, she said to be sure that you skate on flat surfaces, such as basketball court, 
or I don't remember what it was the other one, but on flat surfaces, in superficies planas. Otherwise, you are going to fall. Okay, let's see. What is item number three? Be sure to put it in correctly. Then punch in your secret code. Remember to press enter. And don't forget to count your money before you walk away from the machine. Okay, what is that? You want me to play it again? On a flat surface, such as a parking lot, a tennis court, or a basketball court. Three, be sure to put it in correctly. Then punch in your secret code. Remember to press enter. And don't forget to count your money before you walk away from the machine. So what is that? What is the item? ATM car. ATM car. ATM car is when you go to the ATM machine, ATM teller. Okay, so what are the advices? Try to put the car correctly. Okay. Number two, be sure, be sure to enter your num uh, your code your ATM car code. And don't forget to count your money. Okay? okay. Very good. Now, here okay. we have this reading, okay? That is for you. A day in your life, mm, but in you. the year 2020, which is now, <laughs> okay? <laughs> that is about to finish. We want to finish this year, okay? So, scan the article, that means read it fast, then add the correct heading to each paragraph. Okay, so you see this paragraph, which okay. is the correct heading? This one, or this one, or this one, or this one, or this one. Or this one. Okay. You understand what is heading? Yes. Okay, so, now, listen carefully. People used to know more or less how their children will live. Now things are changing so quickly that we don't even know what our own lives will be like in a few years. What follows is how experts see the future. Now, number one, you're daydreaming behind the wheel of your car, but that's okay. You have it on automatic pilot. And with its high-tech computers, your car knows how to get you home safely. So what paragraph is that? What is the best heading for this paragraph? Getting along around. Ah, okay, very good. Getting around, excellent, okay. Getting around, excellent. Okay, but now before I go on, I want to see who else is here. Hey, hello, Beatriz. How are you tonight? I'm fine. Thank you. Okay, very but, good. What about you? I am fine. Thanks for asking. Okay. Hello, tell me, how are you tonight? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Thanks. Okay, very good. So, we are doing this exercise, this article, okay? And on each paragraph, we are trying, we are figuring out what is the correct heading, okay, for each paragraph. Like for example, for this one is getting around. Okay, let's read number two, okay? You head for the kitchen when you get home. You ordered groceries by computer an hour ago and they've been delivered. You paid for them before they've arrived. The money was automatically deducted from your bank account. Nobody uses cash anymore. So what is the correct heading for this paragraph? 
Shopping. 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 Correct. Shopping. shopping. Very good. Shopping. Okay. Now, number three. What's for lunch? In the old days, you used to stop off to get a hamburger or pizza. Now you use your diagnostic machine to find out which food your body needs. Your food preparation machine makes you a salad. What's the name of this paragraph? And can you see the picture? That is the eating? picture. Uh -huh, exactly, eating. Okay, very good. Next, yeah. after lunch, you go down the hall to your home office. Here, you have everything you need to do your work. You never have to commute to work anymore. Working. Commute means go and come back from work. Go and come back from work. So what is the name of this paragraph? Working. Exactly, very good, working. Okay, now. The next one, your information screen says that you received a message from a coworker in Brazil. You set your computers to translate Portuguese into English. Your coworker's face appears on the screen and the translation appears at the bottom. So communication. What is the name of this part? Communicating. Communicating, very good. Okay, and obviously this is relaxing, right? You finish working and go back to your living room. You turn on the television and look through the list of the new movies. It's like having a video store in your home. How about a classic tonight? Maybe Back to the Future? What is the name of this paragraph? Relaxing. 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 Very Relaxing. Very good. Now, here, read the article and check true or false for each statement about the future. Then write true information for each false statement. So number one, you need to pay attention while driving. What does it say right here? You have it on automatic pilot. So you yep. don't need to pay a, 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 a attention while driving. Your car has automatic pilot. Is that clear? Yeah. Okay, now number two, you pay for your groceries when they arrive. Is that true? False. False. What is true? Uh, you pay uh, before I arrive. Uh -huh. You pay for them before they before arrive. They arrive. Okay. okay, so that's what is supposed to be written here. Okay, very good. Now, the next one. Okay, people don't use cash anymore. True or false? True. 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 It says right here, nobody no. uses this cash anymore. Okay, very good. The next one. You usually buy a hamburger or pizza for lunch. Is that true? True. True. No? So no, it's, it's false. It's, it's, it's false. false. You used to. You used to, but not anymore. The stuff of uh -huh. to get you hamburger to, or pizza. Exactly. You used to stop off to get a hamburger or pizza. Not anymore. Okay. What do you do now? So that's why you're right. You used to stop off to get a hamburger or pizza. Now you, you, you use your diagnostic machine to find out which foods your body needs. And your food preparation machine makes you a salad. Okay, next. You need to go to the office every day. Is that true? False. False. So what do you do? It's false. It's false. What is what is true? You it's never false. you never have to communicate to work anymore. Uh -huh. You never have to commute to work anymore. Okay, very good. The next question. You and your coworkers have to speak the same language. Is that true? It's false. It's false, it's false. right? 
Your co-work is a free in the spring and the Portuguese translation. And English. Uh -huh. You said your computer to translate Portuguese, Portuguese into English. To English. Right. And your co-worker face appear on the screen and the translation appears at the bottom. So you can speak on your own language with somebody. Okay. Okay. Very good. Then next one. When you get a message, you can see the sender's face. Hello. When you get a message, Hello. you can see the sender's face. It's true. It's true, right? It's true. Your information true. screen says that you receive a message from a co-worker in Brazil. So you set your computer. Co-worker face up here. Uh -huh. And your computer and your co-worker's face appears on the screen. Face appears on the screen. That is correct, sir. Very good. Okay, very good. And the last one. You have to go to a video store to rent movies? False. What is true? And you turn on the television. Uh, it's like having video store in your home. It's okay. like having a video store in your home. Why? Because you turn on you your turn cell phone television and look through the, the list of the new movies. Of the new movies. Is that clear then? Very good. Okay. So with this, we finish. And let me show you, okay? Uh, before... Before we continue, let me see your faces. Okay, who else is here? Danny. Okay, so we have only four, six people. Okay, now let me show you. Okay, for to by Sunday, by Sunday, this week, by Sunday, you need to have work on the on the platform. What do you have to do? You see all this? This is a homework. Knowledge check 1.5. 1.4 is about two part verbs. Then you have to do knowledge check 1.9. That is about request with models. You remember? Uh, can, could, would, and would you mind? and the reading exercise that we did last night. Okay, today, ah, I'm sorry, we did this, yeah, last night. And yesterday we practiced infinitive and your own for uses and purposes. And you have to do the knowledge check 2.2 by Sunday, by Sunday. And yesterday we work on all this and work with imperatives and infinitive for giving suggestions. Yeah, try to remember, make sure to go there. Uh, don't forget to stay safe. Okay, so you do knowledge check 2.9. Right now, we finish the reading exercise, a day in your life. So you can do this exercise during the day tomorrow or uh, try to complete the platform during the day. Now, okay. we are going to do this, relative clauses of time. So you can do tomorrow, knowledge check. So the rest, we can do it here tomorrow. So by the, by the end of the week, you can take the midterm. Is that clear? Hello? Okay. Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 Okay, very good. So now, let's continue. Okay, now we're going to start unit number uh, oh. unit number eight, right? Mm -hmm. Let's celebrate. Okay, so holidays okay. and festivals. So we have here some holidays. The Chinese New Year is in January or is in February. Chinese people celebrate with firecrackers and lion dances. Questions? Firecrackers, huetes. Firecrackers. Oh, yeah. yeah. Huetes, okay? 
Sorry. Now, Valentine's Day, February 14. People in many countries give chocolates, flowers, or jewelry to people they love. Okay? Questions? No. No question. Children's Day. No question. May 5th. Japanese families put up color streamers shaped like fish in honor of their children. Streamer, streamer. Streamers are like this, okay? Streamers, okay? These are streamers. Okay. Shaped like fish. Okay, like fish. Honor. Okay, date of the dead, November 2nd. Mexican families offer food on the dead and then have a meal in a cemetery. Questions? It's okay. No, it's okay. Okay, now, these are some celebrations and what do the people do? Now, let's hear celebrations. From this vocabulary that we have here, let's pick up some celebrations. What are the celebrations that we make? Anniversary. Anniversary. So we write here, special occasion, anniversary. What else do we do? Wedding. Wedding. Weddings. Very good. Wedding. Weddings. Okay. So you put here, anniversary, wedding. What else do we do? Christmas. So you put here, Christmas. It's another celebration. In a, it's another special occasion. What is another special occasion in November? Thanksgiving. Ah, Thanksgiving. So you write right here, Thanksgiving. Now, let's go. We have anniversary. Anniversary. What is the special food and drink in the anniversary? Cake. Cake, Cake and wine. Right? Cake and wine. If you are very sophisticated, champagne. Okay. If you don't have money, caña rica, okay? <laughs> if you don't have money, okay, it's okay. <laughs> but you celebrate. <laughs> okay, now, the next one is weddings. What is the special food and drink in the weddings? Mm. Fish. Okay, maybe fish. Cake. A cake. Champagne. Very good. Champagne. 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 And yeah. Okay. And okay, very good. Now dancing. Yeah, but those are the activities. Oh. Okay, so here only the food and the drink. Now in okay. Christmas, what are the um, special food and drink? Roast turkey. Roast turkey. What else? Fruit punch. What? Fruit punch. Ah, fruit punch. Yeah, that's correct. Fruit, fruit punch. punch. Okay, and the last one we had Thanksgiving. What special food and drink in Thanksgiving? The roast same show. The same, right? A uh, roast turkey. Roast turkey. Roast turkey. And maybe fruit punch. Okay. Now, activities. Let's go to the activities. In the anniversary, what are the activities? Give a present. Dancing. 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 Presents. Presents. And later, and, and later, other activities. Okay. To celebrate. Okay. okay. <laughs> now, uh, for. That is Thanksgiving. That was anniversary. And the wedding? What are the activities? A party. A party. What else? Dancing. Dancing. Okay, very good. Cards? No. No. No, no, no cars. Cars? <laughs> well, cars is for anniversary. Maybe fireworks? Fireworks. No, fireworks. What means fireworks? Maybe, no, maybe, no. maybe, maybe, maybe. It's activity. Yeah. If yes. you are very, if you have money, fireworks. What now, is the meaning about fireworks? Fireworks on a, a 
son uh, juegos artificiales. artificiales. Juegos artificiales. Mm, right. yeah. Firecrackers, cohetes. Ok, ok. Firecrackers, cohetes. And uh, fireworks, juegos artificiales. Okay. Okay, now, in Christmas, what are the activities? Mm, what is Maybe the insane. Fireworks. 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 Uh-huh. Dancing. Fireworks. And, and dancing. party. And party. And party. Yeah, it's Turkey. Ah, oh, perdón. I know that is they here. Right. <laughs> yes. okay. okay, now what about a, a, a Thanksgiving? What are the activities? It's turkey. Sorry. It's, it's the food. <laughs> what do people do in Thanksgiving? Uh, what activities? Eat. <laughs> eat eat yeah. and say thanks. Maybe fry. Okay, very Eat good. Now, and potato salad. Okay, <laughs> now, what is the things that we give or we receive in the anniversary? Present. 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 Romantic date. Flowers. 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 Okay. Flowers. Cars. 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 Right, okay, very good. And for the wedding, what do we receive? Present two. Presents. Presents and cars. All right. Oh, Presents and cars. And for Christmas, what do we receive? Pre Pre Presents Pres and cars. And cars. Right. And for uh, Thanksgiving, what do we receive? The turkey. Brass <laughs> turkey. Brass turkey. <laughs> now, and in, the, in Independence Day, what is the activity in Independence Day? Para, para, para parade. Parade, right? Parade means, parade. parade means the feeling, right? So yeah. there is a parade. Okay, very good. Excellent. Now, let's go here and see more of this. of this uh, a celebration. Okay, now, here I have, let's celebrate, okay? Now, with more vocabulary. Okay, we, we have all this vocabulary here. As you can see, okay. they've already used holidays, okay? Now, two of the most important national holidays. 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 In the United States are Independence Day and Thanksgiving Day. Independence, Independence Day, Day, the 4th of July. 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 Correct. Okay. Marks the United States Declaration of Independence. 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 From Britain. Most towns, big and small, celebrate the 4th of July with parades and fireworks. 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 Okay, very good. Now, families celebrate with barbecues or picnic. For us, picnic. Or picnic. picnics. Very good. Thanksgiving Day is celebrated on the for Thursday in November. It is a day when people give thanks for the families. No, for the no. best no. harvest. For the harvest, harvest. right? Harvest. For the harvest. For the harvest. Most, most have families. a large dinner. Most so most families. Most families. Uh, have a large have dinner, a large with, dinner roast with roast turkey. With roast turkey. Roast turkey. Roast turkey. Very good. Uh, Very good. Okay, now let's go back to to here. Okay. okay. Perspective is special days. Now, my favorite holiday is Thanksgiving. It's, it's a day when North Americans celebrate the harvest. Everyone in the family gets together at our house. 
I cook a large turkey and serve it with cranberry sauce. Questions? No. No question. No questions? No. No, no question. question. Okay, very good. No. February 14 is the day when people give cars and presents to the ones they love. I'm really looking forward to Valentine's Day this year. I already have the perfect gift for my girlfriend. Boyfriend. <laughs> Well, for her boyfriend, no, but if for my girlfriend, I have the perfect gift, okay? okay? <laughs> Got to be careful here. Okay. Is that clear? Yes, it's clear. Yes. Okay. I can't wait until the end of the year. New Year's Eve is a night when I have fun with my friends. We usually have a party at someone's house. We stay up all night and then go out for breakfast in the morning. Questions? Anyone? No. No, no questions. Question. Okay, no. let me let me clear something for you. Okay. In uh, uh, we have Christmas. Christmas Eve is December 30, uh, 24th. Okay. And Christmas Day is December 25th. It's December 25th. The same happens with New Year. Uh, New Year's New Year's Eve is December 31st. Okay? And New Year's and New Year's Day it is December, no, it's January first. Okay. What mean Eve? Eve evening, evening. Okay. Christmas Eve is uh, December 24th, and Christmas Day is December 25th. Okay, when you say Eve, is la víspera de Navidad. Okay. La víspera de Año Nuevo, okay? So Christmas Eve, okay. December 24th. Como Noche Buena. Ajá, la Noche Buena, and Christmas Day is December 25th. Okay. New Year's Eve is December 31st, okay. and New Year's Day is January the 1st. Is that clear? Okay. Yes. Okay, very good. Now, let's go back. Okay, now let's see. We have more. We have more students. Hello, Nuria. Hello, Vanessa. How are you tonight? Hello. Hello, teacher. I'm fine. You? I'm, I'm fine. Really Thanks fired. for asking. Okay, I've been now. working all day. Okay, no problem. So you're going to relax here, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, now here. Relative clauses of time. Thanksgiving is a day when North Americans celebrate the harvest. February 14 okay. is the day when people it give cars to the ones they love. Okay. And New Year's Eve is the night when I have fun with my friend. So you see a day. The day. The this one, because it could be not a specific day. date. New Year is not a specific night. Okay. But February 14 is a specific date. So that's why they use the day. 
and when North Americans celebrate. Is that clear? It's exactly what we have here. It's the day when North Americans celebrate. Okay? Is that clear? February yes, 14 clear. is the day when people give cars and presents to the ones they love. And New Year's Eve is a night when I have fun with my friends, okay? Very good. Now, yes. I want you that you take a picture of this. Take a picture. Or if you have the book, it's in the book. It's on page okay. 51. So take a picture and you match letter A with letter B in pairs. Is that clear? In pairs. So I'm going to break you. Do, do you take a picture? Yes, I have. Everybody? Hello, everyone. Did no you teacher. take a picture? I don't know. I don't know. Yes, teacher. Not yet. He, no, teacher. I'm going to put it right there so you can take a picture. Okay, okay. You have One it? Moment, please, teacher. No problem. No problem. Okay, I have the picture. Okay, very good. Now I'm going to put you in groups so you can. Okay, so we have two three, six, eight. So we're gonna make four pairs. Okay, go ahead. Uh, Delmi and Lester, room number one. Nuria and Vanessa, room number two. Janet and Luis, room number three. Beatriz and Danny Sandoval. So match, match the parts, okay? With their correct part. Okay, Delmi, room number one. Vanessa, room number two. Luis, room number three. Delmi, room number one. Delmi, room number one, please. Okay.
Hello, teacher. Hello, Carlos. Were you able to uh, to practice? No, I I'm joined. You, right you now. just got in. Sorry. You just got in. Don't worry. Okay, we are going to start checking this out in a minute. Were you able to finish, Janet? Yes. Yes, we finish. Okay, you finish with Luis. Yes. Okay, they are coming in, in a few minutes. Okay. Okay, everybody's coming. Okay, don't worry about it. Okay, thank you. Here they are. Okay, now let's check it out. Okay? Let's check it out. Now, number one, uh, Janet. When people have party with no, 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 family no, 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 no. and friends. Number one, New Year's. Our New okay. Year days is a day when people have party with family and friends. Uh huh. The New Year's Day is a day when people have parties with family and friends. Okay, Beatriz, number two. Turn on your microphone, Beatriz. Sorry. April Fool's Day is a day when people sometimes play tricks on friends. Exactly. April Fool's Day is a day when people sometimes play tricks on friends. Okay, this is the innocent day that we call in December 28th, April Fool's Day, but it's in April. Okay, very good. Excellent. Luis, number three. May and June are the months when Brazilians celebrate carnival. No. 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 Okay. May and June. I, I think that many young adults show many... to get married. Okay. 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 Again, again, Luis. May, May and June are May and June are the Many young adults choose to get married. Uh -huh. Choose to get married. Very good. Nuria, Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is a day when people express their love to someone. Exactly. When people express their love to someone. Excellent. Okay. Next, Lester. Turn on your microphone, Lester. Sorry, uh, Labor Day is a day when um, people in many countries honor workers. Exactly, Labor Day is a day when people in many countries honor workers. This is El Día del Trabajo, okay? And it's in September, okay? Next, uh, Delmi. February is the month when Brazilians celebrate Carnival. Okay, February is the month when Brazilians celebrate Carnival. Okay, now let's move to this real quick, okay? Now, complete the sentences with the clauses in the box, okay? Now, I want you to take a look at them, okay? Let's do number one together. I hate April 15th. In the United States is the day I always owe the government money. So is the day, huh? Is the day when people pay taxes. When the people pay taxes. Okay, now. I will give you three minutes so you can do it alone, okay? And decide which one belongs to the other one, okay? Think about it. I will give you three minutes. Is that clear? Hello? Yes? Clear. Okay, yes. very good. So go ahead.
Have you finished? Yes. Everybody? Yes. Yes, Carlos? Turn on. Not yet. Not yet, Beatriz? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, let me see the others. Danny, have you finished, Danny? No, teacher. Okay, I'll give you more time. Tell me. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, very good. Luis? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, let's see. Volunteer to do number one. Number one. I hate a fifteen. In the United States is the day when people pay taxes. I always owe, owe the government money. Okay, very good. Danny, do you have number two, Danny? Turn on your microphone, Danny. Yes, teacher. I don't like September. It's the month um, when the student in the United States take exam. Okay, but that one will be this one, uh, Danny. No, will be this one. When, when the school starts. Uh huh. I don't like September. Is the month when a school when starts. starts. I always miss summer vacation. Okay, very good. Uh, tell me, what about number three? Tell me. Sorry. No, it's okay. It's okay. June. Okay. Okay. June is my least favorite month. Is the month. When students in the United States take exams, I never studied enough. Very good, excellent, very good. Uh, Luis, what about number four? No, wait, Carlos, what about number four, Carlos? Okay, I have... I have never liked winter. It's a season when I felt sad and depressed. The cool weather always affects my mood. Okay, very good, that is excellent. Now, this is going to be a homework for you. Use the word from the unit to complete the crossword puzzle. Now, this is on page 44, page 44. Now, look, Chris and Max, and Max wedding ceremony, right? Was in a beautiful old church. Okay, now a cross means like this, a cross, a cross. And these are down, right? Down, like this, down, mm -hmm. down, all right? So perfect. Okay. Okay, okay. so this is going to be homework. I'm going to do just a couple with you. For example, people in the United States, that is number six, people in the United States and Canada celebrate the, the what? Do you remember what they celebrate? Especially. What they celebrate, do you remember? Thanksgiving. No, what do they celebrate harvest. in Thanksgiving? Harvest. The harvest, right? So you right here, harvest. A harvest. A R B E S T. Harvest. Okay, now the harvest. Ah, now down. Number one down. So we're gonna do this one. Okay, number one down. I gave my grandmother a bouquet of
on Mother's Day? A bouquet of flowers. Flowers. F flowers. L O W E R S. Is that clear? A bouquet of flowers. Yes. So that's going to be your homework. Okay. So do okay. the puzzle. Okay. Now, okay. let's go back here. Winter. Winter is the month or winter is the season when? It's our starting. winter. Our winter. What happens in our winter here in El Salvador? What happened in we our start winter? to rain. Uh -huh. So winter is the season when it rains. It's right? Rain. Let me put it like this. Okay. Winter is the season when when it rains okay winter is the season when it rains is that clear yes okay or winter is the season when people get wet is that clear Yes. Winter is the season yes, when is. you have to wear your jacket, raincoat, your raincoat. Is that clear? Yes. Yes? Very good. Very good. Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. Now, let's go with number two. That was winter. What about birthdays? Uh huh. Somebody, birthday. There, there are days there when. Are days when, when. When people celebrate. 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 New year. Celebrate. Okay. Celebrate. A new year. It's okay. Uh huh. His Birthdays life. are days. Their life. When, uh huh. It's Birthdays okay. are days when people get older. <laughs> no younger, <laughs> older. Okay. <laughs> A spring is the time. The year. A spring is the time of the year when the flowers blossom. Blossom is se abren, okay? Florecen. Florecen. A spring is the time when the animals get out of their caves. What is Mother's Day? It's a day when... A, Mother's Day is a day when the people... When the people... When many countries... Give, give, give the present. Give present. Okay, um, that Mother's Day is a day when we honor, when we honor, you remember honor? Our mother. Yes. Mother's Day honor is a day us. when we give a present to, a to our mothers. Mother's okay. Day is a day when we give flowers to our mothers. Okay. Okay, a wedding anniversary is a time. When people... Uh -huh. Nuria, make a party. A wedding anniversary is the time when we make a party. Nuria, another idea. A wedding anniversary is a time when when married se dice people. When uh -huh. se dice 25 años. No, that is when... uh, that is a uh, uh, ah. The 25th wedding. wedding anniversary, but this is only wedding anniversary, aniversario de bodas. Okay. A wedding anniversary is a time when married people yeah. celebrate. Yeah, or when the husband gives to her 
wife a present. <laughs> present. Ah, and the wife don't give to the to the husband. Mm. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, guys, very good. Now, remember, tomorrow we are going to finish this part. Okay, so don't miss tomorrow's class. Remember okay. that tomorrow we are going to continue. We stop right here, right? We stop right okay. here. Relative clauses of time. That's what we practice. So you can do knowledge check. And tomorrow... We are going to do this, adverbial clauses of time. You do the, 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 the homework and then the reading, and then you are able to do the midterm test, okay? Okay. Okay, so thank you very okay. much for your attendance. I want, I want to thank for uh, doing your exercises and for participating, and I will see you tomorrow, okay? Okay. Remember, see you tomorrow, we, have, Mr. Tomorrow, we so. have classes tomorrow because we are replacing Monday and Tuesday from last week. Okay. Yes. Okay. So we have classes tomorrow. Next week we we'll go back to normal Monday to Thursday. Okay. 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 Have so a much. wonderful okay. night. Thank you. Okay. For you too. Bye bye. Bye. Okay. Bye, bye. 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 Have bye. a wonderful night, please. You too. Thank, Thank you. you try to rest. Okay, I will rest definitely. <laughs> Good night. Good night.